What's up everyone, welcome back. Today, I bring to you another PC build. This time, my budget was around $600. First things first, the case that I'm using is Cooler Master, Master Box Q300L, same one as in my first PC build. I'm familiar with it, you know, I like what it offers. It's not bad, I mean, the only issue I have with it is just the cable management in the back. For the graphics card, I'm using ASUS Single Fan Phoenix 1650 Super. For the processor, I'm using Ryzen 5 2600, 500 gigabyte SSD, uh, 2x8 DDR4 RAM. And for the motherboard, I'm using ASRock B450M Pro 4. The reason I'm using this is I heard it was the best for micro ATX. Uh, I'm not sure, but just went ahead had had good reviews so I went ahead and picked it up all right so stay tuned for my build
all right so we got the PC completed now let's go ahead turn it on and install Windows on it make sure everything works oh forgot to turn the power switch on don't forget to do that All right, powered on, no problem. Okay, as you can see now, I'm on the BIOS screen here. You can see the motherboard I'm using, the processor, RAM, RAM speed. All right, so I already have Microsoft installed on this USB. Okay, I went ahead and changed my RAM frequency to what it can handle. All right, so when you're here, go to boot and just choose USB SanDisk partition for boot option. All right, make sure that one is chosen. All right, then you just go through the usual steps and install Windows. Just give me a few minutes for this one. All right, guys, so as you can see, the PC is complete. It's on, it's working. Windows is installed. Now all I have to do is just go ahead, make sure the Wi-Fi works, and I'm set to go. All right, guys, if you guys enjoyed watching this video, please go ahead, leave a like. Don't forget to comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell to get a notification whenever I upload any new videos. And again, thanks for watching.